of us have been in the outdoors or somewhere where time stands still, the worst gets real quiet, and you start hearing and seeing things that you didn't know were there. And uh, especially early in the morning, you can imagine what that's like for a guy with traumatic brain injury, uh, physical brain damage, or post-traumatic stress disorder, uh, PTSD, which is the mental part of it. It was grinding along the slope. Well, I guess I'll be going. Best be on my way. We'll talk again tomorrow. Maybe the next day. And I pull out on the highway. An empty field inside. All right, my name is Jim Dolan. I'm the uh, National Coordinator for Heroes on the Water. We take uh, injured troops kayak fishing as our big thing, and we found out it's been amazingly therapeutic for them. There's more to this than just taking guys kayak fishing. This is this is something different, and that's what we do. What we're doing with these guys. Most of these guys are from Fort Bragg. I believe there's a couple of guys from uh, a couple of Marines from Camp Lejeune, and just getting guys out on the water, give them a chance to relax. Uh, they get triple therapy, if you will, at once. They get uh, physical therapy because they're out paddling and, and uh, fishing. They get mental therapy because they can just totally relax. And they can they get uh, occupational therapy because this is something they can do the rest of their lives. And all those little things lift and done. And all those things I really needed to see. They stay locked in my soul that way. Yeah. Got a nice little large mouth. Caught him on a grape and fire tail power bait on an eighth ounce number three aught weighted hook. We're fishing 14 pound spider wire so we can cast right up in the rocks where they're at, so we can pull them out of the timber too. And we're gonna measure this guy up. He's 14 and a quarter inches. We're gonna put her back in there really gentle. Kinda rock her back and forth. And there she goes. No worse for wear. And it haunts me today. I guess it'll haunt me. To the end. Words never said before, but they can't be said again. And tomorrow may never come. Yeah, it's a, it's a benefit tournament for Heroes on the Water. I think you charge about $45 a person entry fee for it, and then uh, the proceeds of that minus his expenses are obviously going to go to Heroes on the Water and help us out. Uh, anything we can do to, to get people to help us, and, and you're helping guys that have literally given a piece of themselves mentally and or physically for their country. For another day. Most fishermen are... Uh, like to tell stories. <laughs> we tell some pretty good stories and, and do a lot of trash talking and stuff and that's the kind of environment most military guys have come from is that trash talking, telling stories and having a good time, hanging out with their buddies. And we want to give them uh, that band of brothers to join and, and, and be part of and uh, I think we do a pretty good job of it. They really, most guys really seem to enjoy coming out and hanging out with us and we want to turn them into kayak fishermen. The best, biggest compliment we can get from one of them is say, hey, Give me a call, and they'll call me up or call Corey up and say, Hey, Corey, let's go fishing. And at that point, we've turned him into a kayak fisherman, made him part of our group and our band of brothers.